Greetings and welcome back to Dungeon Defenders Awakened. I'm Catherine of Sky and we are, uh, I have organized all the heroes again. One of the things that has been perplexing me, and I didn't know how the heck this worked, is the bag system. I was like, can I not just drag this into a bag or something? No, no. These are filters. These bags are f only filters. And I'm like, what? This is weird, man. Why does this even, this is not, not good. Like what if you have unique items you want to put in a specific bag? Like, I don't get this. It's just weird. All right. Uh, I am going to go ahead and um, filter these uh, because maybe it will help us like, um, oh, wait, I want to copy this. Is that going to keep itself? Maybe. Um, this one, I want to do a, let's see, filter bags. Let's see what we can do. Bag image. We're going to do this as a, I don't know. Sure. Um, quality right now. We're going to choose all of these qualities of stuff. Um, all right. So we're going to do that. This one is going to be accessories. Um, we'll just go ahead and choose all the bag image. Let's see if there's an image of an accessory of some kind here. It's weapons. Oh, there's pets. Lots of pets. That's very cute. We'll use the monocle. That seems good. Um, this one bag three, I didn't know you could choose these separately. Of course it makes sense because you kind of, yeah, have to. All right. This one is going to be fusion weapons v armor misc no i think that's of what we want we only we only want uh that not sure if this is going to work we'll see if this works because the thing about the fusion things one of the things that i have been like oh annoyed with is that when when we've been doing these rifted things um coming across these fusion things <laughs> they're not gold at all they're not gold at all they are this is a common thing this is a purple thing so i want to have all qualities of uh fusion thingy thingies all right these are going to be the gold stuff um you know what i want to also have a bag for pets um let's just do this one for pets oh we should change the name pets um bag image let's get a pet picture we know there are some let's see that is a very sad looking cat oh a gin oh i had so many gins i had several like many or maybe we should choose the mega chicken no i don't want to confuse it is that a giraffe holy fuzzy cats i want a giraffe i want a giraffe um okay so we're gonna do this one that way this one we don't want pets here um this one Hmm, I guess, uh, hmm. what I'm wondering, is this only going to choose fusion pets or I mean fusion items? Let's see what it does. Let's see what it does. I don't know. Let's figure this out. Um, let's see, let's do, we just want to rename these fusion. Okay. And this is, uh, top level. Yeah, I had a very, very extensive um, <laughs> organization system in the original GD. Like nuts levels of organization for stuff. I don't know how I'm going to organize it right now. I would really like to organize it probably by stat. As in, this is, this is fortification plus whatever. Also, this drives me nuts that when I'm standing here, it's actually just shooting stuff. That is so stupid. 
Um, if there's a way to turn that off, please let me know because it's driving me crazy. All right, let's go with the campaign maps. We're off to the keep. Um, let's look. Let's go rifted. Uh, is our hero? Let's uh, actually, I think we're at 59. I don't think we we got to 60 yet. Level 60. All right, here we go. I wish that the, you didn't have to click on that screen. Oh. As they approach an ancient keep, they see a fierce battle unfolding between an agile fighter Whoa. and several ferocious like him. Uh huh. Okay. The rogue. Well then. Deep within the keep, a terrifying screech bellows out, distracting the lichens. Our heroes join the fight Heyo. and help protect <laughs> the potential ally. All right. So we're here at the keep. This is a brand new map to me. I don't think it's been used in any of the other previous Dungeon Defenders games unless it was added after I stopped playing. Uh, let's check out the map here. Wow, we have three crystals to defend. Um, the pathways look precarious. We'll see though, we'll see, let's see. Uh, let's go ahead and press G so we can see the pathways happening here. There, okay, this one, okay, there's a rift here. Oh, I hate these rifts. Those are not nice, man. That prevents us really from doing a lot of stuff because we could mitigate these pathways better, except for the stupid rifts. This is a pain in the socks, man. Look at this pain in the socks right here. Dang. All right, well, it's fine. We'll fix it. It'll be fine. Fine. All right. Let's try to put this as close to this rock. Maybe we put it on top of the rock. Let's put another one like here ish. We'll put the buff beam between them. That one doesn't have good line of sight over there at all. Um, I think we sell that one actually. I don't like that line of sight at all. No, that's not good either. But if we put it up here, that's better. That'd be better, better, better. Okay, so that's one side of this crystal. Um, let's put one here. Put this one, hmm. Actually, this one can take care of a lot of this lane as well. Let's see, if we do two, if we do this one here this way, that might be even better. Oh, no, it has to be on top of that crest there, I think. Let's put it here. Nice. Okay, so that's fine. That's that one protected for now. Here's the rift. So here we're going to put them on top of the stairs. That's going to be kind of important. one there. I like to stack these to, to reduce buff beam costs. This seems like a good strategy. Okay, so this one... Oh, there's another rift up there. Oy. Ick! Dudes, why you do this? Okay, it's fine. We will get it. Um, I am going to assume we're going to get ogres. So that's the way I'm going to build. I mean, ogres from everywhere. Looks like there's nothing coming this way. That's handy. Uh, how about here? What are we doing here? And where's the other crystal? Wow, this is a mess and a half. Look at this. Oi. Okay. Let's put these guys maybe just, uh, just outside the doors. Okay, what do we got left here? Here's the other crystal and we have, wow, okay, this is, oh, this is mucho fun, yay. Mm -hmm. Okay, well. I'm gonna do something very weird here. I'm gonna do this. So 
So, and I think we need a crisp, um, a thingy here. Uh, buff, or, um, like a reflect field here. Do I need it that long? Probably not. Let's see. One, please. That looks pretty good. I guess they could technically hit it from this side. Ah, I see. I see. Uh, we did this wrong. Let's fix that. It needs to be all the way to the edge here. And then just as far as we can there. It's fine. Okay, so these ballistas hopefully are going to kill everything before... Oh, and look at this thing. How naughty this placement is. This is bad. All right. I don't know what we're going to do here. This looks terrifying to me. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put in... I think what we're going to do is get a couple of blockades right here. Uh-huh. And we'll uh, work with that that way. All right. Well, here we go. Here we go. Remember, we got that weapon cooking on this EV here. Let's see. Is it... Is this... This is the one. Wait, did we do any kind of... Uh... Oh, we have stuff. Ooh. We do. We do. We can get this going. 8907 DPS. Oh, wait, what? Oh, no, it's 2812 DPS. Eh? Oh, no, we wanted damage, I think. There we go. Would be 30k damage. 30 plus 9, 5. And if we go to this, 30 plus 9, 5. This one is 20 plus 1. So 21 versus 40. Okay, I think it's time to switch weapons. Uh, let's see. Let's um, unequip this. Let's get the other EV. Let's unequip that. Here, you can have this one. And then we go back to Sparkla, give you this one, and then, then, my friend, actually, take that off, and you can have this one, switch to this, there we go, primary weapon, upgrade, damage, yes, this is massive, this costs 5.6 million for this, how much is our DPS? <laughs> 271,000. That seems good. That seems great, actually. Really good. Pet is doing good uh, as well, but let's upgrade our pet as well. I, I think this is a good idea. We'll just upgrade the pet. 21. I don't think I can afford anymore. Yeah. All right. Well, we got stuff. Pet DPS. Let's look at that. Let's see how much the pet's going to do. All right. This is terrifying, but we're going to try our best. I think these areas should be fine. I think the most concern I should have is for the lower crystal out here in this area. Um, uh, because there's so many... Such an... Oh, do I like this weapon? I should have tried it out before I actually invested in it. But it does hit hard. That's actually better, maybe. Wait, where, where, where? Where? Where has... Wait, what? Help! Which core? This core is under attack. No! I don't know what other core is under... No! Ah, oh, crap. Okay. I think what I'm gonna do is I need to put in, in case... One of the ballistas or harpoons misses. I think we need to have an archer station there. I think that's what we need to really, really need to do. Okay, those are those. La di da di da. Um, dang, this was not good. This was distinctly not good. Looks like a lot of stuff got hit. Oh, that's terrible. All right, well. I wonder if I got a rift prize. I did. But it's only... I don't like that you can't see where the projectiles are. They're t so tiny. Dude, and I upgraded this weapon too. But I mean, it does... It does shoot well. Um, 
does shoot well. All right, let's replay. That was bad. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. We already know about this. Thank you very much, narrator. We appreciate the thingy thingy. We have the fly through. It is fine. All right, let's try this again. Oh, gee. Okay. Invalid location, that's so weird. Okay, and then... And then, of course, we have those stupid rifts here. Not ideal. I feel like I might be spending too much on that. Actually, that one... No, there's a rift there. I think this one we can just put one thingy here. And then I think our issue might have actually been down here. But I don't know. We definitely need a the summoner there. And here, this was also kind of problematic. Weird, weird problematic. All right, let's get our summoner. Um, let's put archers by each of the crystals. Where did they go? Here's one. Where am I? I can't see where I am. This is weird. Uh, okay, well, I think I know where I am. We're at this one, I think. So gonna stand put it right around here or maybe here these folks do have quite a lot of um, DPS so it should be just fine I'm gonna put this one above up here and maybe we link it with a buff beam yeah as long as it covers the crystal we should be fine all right we have one left and I will put that, where do I put that one? Hmm. I could actually put him up here. It's really high up, but you know, you gots to do what you gots to do. I mean, there he is right up there. Okay, uh, let's try that. <laughs> see if that works better. Man, I don't like that you can't see the bullets here because seeing the bullets helps me aim. And when you can't see them, it's such a pain in the socks. It's very bad. So I just spent a lot of money on the wrong gun. Not great. This is also probably a problem. We probably need one of the thingies in that area. Yeah, this is not good. Where, 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 where? What's going on, man? Oh god, oh god. What? Which one? This is rough, man. It's not that core. Uh, run, 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 run! Oh my god, there are so many here. They killed my... my oh, they didn't kill the archer. They did kill the... The other ballista, though. Uh, okay, okay. We're hurrying, hurrying. Oh no, oh no. Is it this one? Jeez Louise. Whoa! That core is almost dead. 
Wow, these are really strong enemies to have in the first wave. This is nuts, man. Well, and we might not be strong enough to do this rifted, actually. Ah, uh, and that's almost deaded. That's not good. All right, let's go around and get um, loot and thingies. Yeah, and having these things almost dead is not good. This one, I think I'm going to have to move this ballista here. That's not very efficient. We need slowing auras for sure right now. Um, this one also got killed prodigiously. Uh, all right, so let's see. What can we do here? Let's put in... All right, monk, you do, you do your thing, man. Uh, and I think we need this strength. Uh, I'm worried about building, overbuilding for, how much does this cost? 60 for a strength drain aura. Okay. All right, let's just put aura stacks in places. I don't know if this was a problem. I kind of feel like I could put in another... Maybe another archer here to help with this situation. Uh, let's see, can I put another one? Can you move people? No. Night, night. Okay. All right. That should help somewhat. All right. Now this one, it looked like most of these were coming from the gate here. Okay, here's the box. Uh, okay, so both of these got destroyed, which is definitely not great. All right, let's do this again. Let's get our monk auras going on here. Okay. Um, and then we also, let's get our spiders. Those are super, super good. Super good. I also put one in the other area as well. Whoopsies. Okay. Let's stick one out here. All right. And then this area, hmm. I feel like this probably really got murdered over here. All right, monk, need you to do your thing, man. Right, these have to be on the beam, probably there. Strength drain. Go to you. Spiders are so useful. Really, really useful. I might even just put a mage and a spider here. Um... I think we'll put in another archer here. All right. So, wow. This might be bad. Uh, I think what we'll do here is um, we need to get this thing. Let's get the thingy here. Man, these two, I didn't count for that pathway there. If I sell this, if I sell this thing, it doesn't, does it tell me how much I get? Two. Wow. Let's repair it for now. We can't even repair it fully. All right, I'm going to just like defend this like crazy. Um, I don't think the towers on this EV will matter. 
So we're just gonna have to defend it ourselves. This is bad. This is really, really bad. Okay, at least that archer up there is a good spot. Oh, no. This one got killed. I wonder, like, I wish they showed the situation. Like, I don't see a single enemy around this crystal. You know, did they, which way did they come from, you know? Ay, okay. I think we need to try this in non-rifted mode. I think the rifted enemies are just too strong. Uh, for our current level of stats, we probably need to grind a bit. Because um, this makes me sad, but I don't think we can do it. I mean, I think we have kind of given our best effort, but it's eh, kind of icky. All right, let's just pick up loot, any loot that we might find here. And see if there's anything. Oh, there is stuff. There is stuff and things. Some of the things I really should, I should really look and see about accessories. No, actually we have been getting gold accessories, so I don't have to pick up inferior accessories. Though, I haven't uh, been looking for specifically like rifted stuff. Like, is this rifted? No, that's not rifted. No, that's not rifted. I wonder if it looks purple. Probably does. Probably does. But yeah, all of the rifted stuff I have is not, uh, isn't gold. All right, so that was bad. All right, so let's go press G. Let's go to the tavern and change the difficulty because this is, you know, I really like to push it because, you know, we want to get the most XP we can from these, but if we can't, we can't. So let's try this one, the keep. Oh, act for finale. Okay, so I bet it's probably supposed to be more difficult. That would make sense. All right, trying it again. Yes, 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 yes. We've seen this already. Thank you very much. Go away. Go away. Okay. All right. Let's do it. It's fine. It'll be fine. It will be fine. Yes. So, no. I meant this. Thank you. All right. Oh my goodness. This is interesting. I'm going to put them a little bit diagonal, I think, and then intersperse the, uh, the thingies in here, the the archers. Six. So put them on the very edge there in hopes that we can get another one on there later. Um, Non-rifted really makes a difference in terms of their, deep, uh, their hit points. Oh my god, I can't get out of here. It's weird. Press enter to chat. Who am I going to chat with? <laughs> I started playing in offline mode, by the way, um, because I feel like um, the... Uh, I, I didn't know wh whether I sh had to play in online mode or offline mode, if I would get progress. You know, like some games, you can't progress if you're in offline mode or whatever. But I just tried it and it's like, oh, okay, cool. Nice. Don't need to worry about people, like, getting into my game and messing me up. Uh, okay, so that's fine. This is fine. Ah, we didn't do this yet, especially with these rifts here. It's a pain in the socks. Do we do these? Yeah, probably. All right, now we can do something down here, which I don't even know. I think it's going to be something like this. And this, that doesn't actually go very far. Wow. 
Okay, so we're going to do something different then. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put in this thing up here. And then we need another, actually, you know what? We're going to take that one off. We're going to get one here to take the rift and the ones coming from that direction. And then the next one is going to go the opposite direction like this. And then I will defend the crystal. Okay. All right. That's what we got right now. I think that's what we got. All right. Let's go. Hopefully these are less damagey. We will see, I guess. Okay. It looks like things are getting mostly killed, partly killed. Yeah, mostly killed. Chicken is killing some stuff too. How much is chicken hitting for? 25,000. That's good. So we spent quite a bit of money on chicken, but chicken is um, doing damages. Really damages. Whoa, 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 dude. Dude. That is not cool, man. Whoa. Wait, what is it? Zero percent. I didn't understand that. That was weird. Oh, 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 which core, which core, which core? Not that core? Is it this core? No, the other core that I'm not paying attention to. Crap. Is the core still under attack? Oh. Oh yes, that one is still under attack. Crap. Why is that? Why is the archer not hitting it? Oh, I bet he's too far out of line of sight. Ugh. Wait, dude. Okay. All right. Well, it went a lot better than the last time when we did with the rifted stuff. So I think, I think we're okay. Um, all right, let's walk around and get the mana and look for stuff. And I do this because it's really hard to focus. Like if you are building towers and collecting mana and collecting drops at the same time, it's like, uh, okay, where was I? What was I doing? Easier just to focus this way. All right. Let's see anything here. This seemed to work a lot better, which is nice. Oh, I need to have a runes folder as well. Runes folder would be amazing, really good, Ling, fantastic -y. Okay, um, let's put one here. Then I do need to have probably a line of these guys. If we get maybe a couple of these folks in here. Let's see, these guys are 5,000 DPS. Okay, that seems to be uh, okay-ish. Let's get our monk out and drop an aura stack out here. Kind of right in the middle, I think. Okay, very good. So next area. How much did, did we get any points for that at all? Five for that wave. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Four. Wouldn't it be cool to have a macro that would just drop an aura stack? I don't know if that's possible or if it's allowed or whatever. Okay, this should help immensely. This tower took absolutely no damage, so I'm quite happy about that. This is going to strengthen this position even more. Um, I'm choosing to do auras over buff beams because I feel like the slowing 
is going to be much more valuable than buffing right now. Uh, okay, so let's get you figured out. Figure the heck out. Can we move you? I think we needed... Okay, that's not great. Maybe we have him... Or maybe we just sell him. Sorry, dude. I'm just going to put them along the top here, I think. And then let's get our spider up here as well. Okay. And then we need an aura stack. Uh, we're out of monkey bits. All right. Let's get the ensnare aura. Whew. Holy fuzzy cats. I think we put it here for now. This area. Okay. And that's, that's what we got really. Um, we did have enemies coming from here. I don't know why, because, oh God. And there could be an ogre coming from here. No, this is scary, man. Uh, all right. I can't believe we're getting ogres on wave two. That's terrifying. We don't even have enough. We just don't have enough crystals, man. Jeez, this is hard, 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 hard. But I feel like maybe we just defend this area. Let's see. And also check the map and see if there are any ogres coming. Uh, oh, there's one coming up there. Uh, help, help. No, no. Go, go. Shoo. Which crystal's under attack? Which one, which one? I don't know. Or under attack. Which one? Dang it. They used to flash. Like on the map, they used to flash if they were under attack. And now... Wait, what? Okay, it just gives us a generic thing. This crystal didn't get destroyed. It was the one on the left. But I don't know why. That is one of the most annoying things about this ending screen. It's like, I don't know why. But it clearly was this crystal that got shattered. Okay, we see it. But what was here? Because I was watching the map, but I didn't see anything specific there. Oh. Is this the loot filter? Oh my god. As in, is this all we get for loot filter is on the, the map here? Is that really what loot filter is? I hope not. I hope not. Oh god, that's horrible if it is. Okay. I feel like ogres on the second wave is really not ideal. I'm really considering going to just farm some points or something and see. Should we try it on hard? Oh my God. We're stepping down to hard, but this was just, this is really strange. Like, what I don't understand about this area here is that we have so many. So we had this, which didn't die. I wonder if it was just a crystal that was, I mean, it, it was an ogre that got the crystal because obviously these guys can't fix that. I mean, I could put the, um, the harpoons here to face that way, but that's a really small kill box over here. Uh, it's much better to have them out there. But then again, this crystal keeps getting destroyed. I mean, it was this door. It's so funny that like a small door like this would have an ogre coming through it. I mean, like a one pathway kind of like, I don't know, just seems like a strange thing, but clearly we are getting ogres. Um, I should have checked the DPS or the, not the DPS, the HP, because we could have put in a few Huntress traps maybe instead. All right. Well, I'm going to regroup and figure out what I want to do. I might do a little bit of farming on other levels um, because I think we need more points. I think we definitely need more points uh, because we're not killing stuff very quickly. But I think also our strategy should be amended uh, to some degree, maybe adding 
or maybe we put maybe we put those things in the back or maybe we put blockades so stuff gets killed maybe that's what we do i don't know or you know the um the thingies the these thingies yeah blockades walls basically wall it off um all right anyway thank you so very much for joining me take care of yourselves and each other and i'll see you next time <laughs>